This video is brought to you by Happy Cart. Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews. In this video, I will show you the top 20 city tweaks that are compatible with iOS 9.1. Portrait Lock. This is a very useful tweak that allows you to choose in which apps you want to enable the portrait lock. So you can see here the portrait lock is not enabled on my device, but when I open the calculator app, you can see it will enable the portrait lock automatically. Preference Organizer 2. This tweak will organize your settings app into four main sections. So you won't have a long list of apps, but you will have four sections. You have the Apple apps, social apps, the tweaks, and also the App Store apps. Album Art Center. This tweak will add the album art of the now playing song as the background of your control center. As you can see it right here and it looks pretty awesome. Now if you jump to the settings of this tweak here you can choose where you want to see it. You can see it only on the media control so it will be the background only of the media controls on your control center or you can set it as a complete background of your whole control center. App Suite Sizer will bring back the old iOS 8 app switcher to your iOS 9.1 device. As you can see the app cards right here. You can also resize them, you can make them smaller or bigger and you can do that by going to the settings of this tweak. Here you have an enable button, then you can set the size with the slider right here. Icon Art. This tweak will replace the icon of the now playing app with the album art of the song that you're listening to. As you can see it right here, the SoundCloud doesn't have its stock icon, but it will have the album art of the song that I'm listening to. Safari tab count shows you how many tabs you have opened in Safari. As you can see here, I have three and it shows it here on the corner of your screen. You can also tap and hold it to close all the tabs except the current tab. Dock Shift. This tweak allows you to change the blur style of the dock on your iOS 9 device. So you can see right here the blur of the dock is much lighter and if you go to the settings of this tweak here you have style. If you go here you can pick between different styles and apply them to the dock of your device. Enable Live Photos. What this tweak does is that it will enable live photos which is a feature of the iPhone 6s and the 6s plus on older devices. So when you open your camera app, you will have this icon right here. And if you tap it, as you can see, now you will enable live pictures and you can take a live picture simply by tapping the shooter button like this and it will take a live picture. iCleaner. This is a very useful jailbreak app which allows you to clean up memory in your device, especially if you have a 16 gig iPhone. This will be very useful for you. It will remove all the unnecessary data from your phone and will free up the space of your iPhone. Walmart. This is a pretty awesome tweak that will change the wallpaper of your device anytime you unlock your device. So you can see right here. Now if I lock and unlock my device, it will be a different wallpaper. You can see it right here. I can lock it again and unlock it and it will have a different wallpaper. You can also set time intervals to change the wallpaper of your device. C Clean. This tweak allows you to customize the control center of your device. As you can see right here, I have hidden all the background images for the toggles the sliders and also the quick launches. Now you can do that by going to the settings of this tweak here so when you can customize your control center just enable and disable any of these toggles and then respring your device for the changes to take effect. Blurred. This tweak will replace the stock white iOS keyboard with this dark keyboard and it looks pretty awesome. On the settings of this tweak all you have here is an enable button to enable or disable this tweak. Animone. This is an alternative to Winter Board, which has never been updated to work with iOS 9. So now you can use Animon, it's pretty awesome. It also has a better UI, so you can see all the changes that you make on the themes of your device. Here you have all the themes that you have downloaded. You just enable them, or you can pick 
each section of the theme to enable just go here and then just enable any section that you want to customize using any mode volume banner this tweak will replace the stock volume hood with the banner as you can see it right here you can see this banner which will appear instead of the volume hood and it's more awesome as you can see it it won't interrupt your screen but it will be as a banner so if you go to the settings of this tweak you have an enable button then you have configuration where you can customize the banner cc settings this is a very useful tweak which allows you to add extra toggles on the control center of your device as you can see them right here now to add them you need to go to the settings go to cc settings and here have all the included toggles and all not included toggles you can rearrange them or you can enable or disable any of them simply by dragging them like this cylinder this is a free alternative to barrel it will add these awesome animations when you swipe through the pages on your home screen now if you jump to the settings of this tweak you have an enable button then here you have all the effects that you can choose from you can also choose more than one effect and create a formula and add a custom animation to the home screen of your device hot dog this tweak allows you to customize the lock screen of your device as you can see here you can change the color of the time and the date also you can add a custom slide to unlock text and change the color of the text you can also do more stuff and to do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak and here you have all the sections of the lock screen that you can customize using hot dog reveal menu this tweak will add the 3d touch features to older devices so you can see i can tap and hold an icon and it will show me the quick action menu it will also add the 3d touch switcher feature as you can see if i tap and hold i can go to the app switcher and it will also add the peak and pop feature you can see here i can peak and pop into this note as you can see pretty awesome and it works pretty smoothly log glyph it will add this awesome animation on the lock screen of your device when you use touch id to unlock your device as you can see you have an animation and also a sound if you go to the settings of this tweak here you have three sections where you can customize the appearance the behavior and also the animations of lock glyph no slow animations this is a tweak which will speed up the animations of your ios 9.1 device you can see when i open and close an app how fast this animation is and on the settings of this tweak all you have to do is just enable it and then here you can set the speed of the animations using this slider right here so that's it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed it for more ios 9.1 jailbreak videos please make sure you subscribe also go ahead and follow me on twitter you will find the link to my twitter account in the description of this video